I was making dinner in the kitchen and my kids were busy doing all the things that kids do after school. Someone was doing their homework, someone was watching Barney on TV and I had said to the kids after they had had their afternoon snack, no more, nothing, nada, nobody can have anything else. Is everybody clear? Because I'm making a great dinner and no one can have another snack. So I was standing at the sink and in those mother eyes that are in the back of my head, I could feel that someone was in the pantry. And so I turned around and there was William. So I walk over to the pantry and I said, William, look at mama. Well, he turns around and his one little hand is behind his back and his head is down. And, and I said, William, look at me. And he looks up and little Oreo cookie crumbs were falling gently from his lips. And I said to him, William, what are you doing? And he said, nothing. I said, William, what happens when you tell mama a lie? He said, big trouble. I said, and what happens when you tell me the truth? Well, see. And so I said to him, well, honey, do you want to tell mama the truth? And you could just watch his little mind. He's standing there, and I know he's processing. What do I want? Big trouble, mussy. Big trouble, mussy. And he takes what seems like an eternity to decide what he wants. And so in about 30, 45 seconds, this little grimy hand comes out from behind his back, and he opens his fingers, and there are two Oreo cookies. And I said to him, oh, William, Thank you for telling mama the truth. I am so grateful that you told me the truth. And because you told me the truth, you're not gonna get a spanking. But because you disobeyed, you're gonna have to go stand in the corner. And so he says to me, that's mercy. <laughs> I said to him, yes, that's mercy, honey. I'm Angela, and that's my D6 story.